Hey guys, what's going on? It's guys, go be react to what? Jessica. Guys, they're going to be reacting to how soon affects your life. Khalid Yassin. Guys, let's go straight into this. Hanawatala have shown us that all of these people who seem to be having fun, who have become the heroes, the television, the movie stars, the poster stars, the magazine stars, looking like they're all happy and proud and big homes and big money, so far they are the most miserable people. They die early, they are diseased, they live with despair. They wind up lonely and living in dark places. They are the most frustrated people, and when they die, they have no legacy whatsoever. Why? Because everything that the Creator told us not to do, when we do it, it winds up with disease. You name it. If the Creator told us not to drink alcohol, what is one of the greatest diseases in the world today? If the Creator told us not to use drugs, what is one of the greatest diseases in the world today? If the Creator told us not to fornicate, not to commit adultery, what is the greatest disease in the world today? Sexually transmitted diseases. If the Creator told us to be fair, don't take interest, what is the greatest source of stress in the world today? Debt. Everything the Creator said don't do, if you do it, because you have the will to do it, it ends up with disease. Everything the Creator said to do, if you do it, it winds up as a gift. It winds up as a refinement. It winds up as an acquired habit. It winds up as something that you can leave as a legacy. If the Creator said, do good actions, a person that tells the truth he builds around them and insulates around themselves, children, society, corporation, business, government that is built upon truth. Truth only leads to truth. Lies only lead to lies. When the Creator said to us, perform worship, recognize, pay tribute, complete the terms, when you see that a person is driven by faith, when you see that a person's life falls within the parameters of faith, a person's conscience is driven by faith. When a person, it brings about honor, it brings about integrity, it brings about strength, support, reputation. Today, as a result of the fact that the Creator has said to us, respect each other, we have no more family values. And what has the loss of family values led to? Again, disease. Hmm. Guys, this actually makes sense, guys. Like, sin really affects our life. To be honest, if you are a, a believer, a believer of God, I won't say Christian, Islam, Buddha, and if you're a believer of God, you know God and you commit sin. And it affects you, to be honest. You feel bad except you don't really care but if you care you, you feel bad like when you come into sin it torments you like it's a, like it brings you down it makes you less of yourself to be honest then you have to beg of forgiveness and you still have to forgive yourself but to be honest if you abstain from sin i feel you go you're able to move faster in life to be honest you know you're doing the right thing you get that kind of motivation like you know you're doing the right thing and you know God have your back because you're doing the right thing. It actually pushes you faster. And as I said, if you are staying from sin, you are staying from a lot of diseases. Mm -hmm. To be honest, like sexual transmitted diseases, smoking and having cancer, lungs, alcohol, fever, but see those kind of things when you when you have liver failure, kidney failure, it's 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 a whole lot. Hmm. It's something you don't pray you can see or see someone who has it because you feel bad yourself. You try to, but I told you so. Hmm. What do you think about this? Okay, like I I don't know. I've always wondered why 
you know, the thing he said about celebrities, like people on posters and everything, I've always like wondered why is your life like some of them, why is their life so short? Why and do they always, always yes, why do most of them like I feel like most of the people that end up in depression are actually celebrities and then you see like they have the perfect life that no, most people don't. want, but they don't. why? They no, do. like that is how we see. Like, like wait, they see. have the life that because we if, want to. If you see it, uh, they are always working. Mm. Like you understand, you have you can have like twelve hours of your day to yourself, just sit, have fun. But they are always working, like from this show to this show to this meeting to this meeting to this video shooting, shooting, shooting. When they go home, they are alone. Like, they don't have the time to actually keep people from their soul. Like, they're always working and doing drugs to keep them active and stuff. They're meeting different people. It's depressing because, like, you don't have... Most of them don't really have someone to call their own. Most times when they get married, something, 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 they end up divorcing. Okay, yeah, they're, they're married, like, it's always it very short. Last. So guys, so what you think about this video, just like, share, subscribe to our channel. We'll see you next time, guys.